welcome to J-Hook Magic. I'm Jess. Thank you so much for coming and stumbling along my channel and wanting to hang out with me. I truly appreciate it. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. How are you? How are you? I hope all is well. If you haven't already and you'd be ever so kind, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when new videos have been posted. If it's not your first time here, welcome back my yarny friends so excited you are here it has been a minute and look at this hair i need a haircut so bad anywho um it is the holiday season so you know it's crazy <laughs> it has been super duper crazy at work so i have not had a chance to get on here make a video but here I am so today is wearable whip Wednesday this is uh where I come on and I'm trying to work on getting better at making wearables uh who doesn't want to wear cute crochet things out you know uh I'm also doing this along with uh Heather from strings and threads Teresa from critters crochet and Kenyatta from Kenyatta creates I will have them linked down below. Go check them out. Um, they are some fabulous ladies. Uh, go see what they're making and what they are all about. So, uh, what I'm working on now is I have, um, all right, well first, boop, 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 boop. let me rewind. Uh, I don't know how many months ago Was it for my birthday? No. Anyway, a few months ago, um, my husband and I were in uh, Ollie's and, uh, you know, looking around. And of course, I got to check out the yarn, right? And normally they just have the same light blue, red heart, super saver uh, that they always have. But this time when I went, they had this uh, super saver color block in the colorway frosted honey honey honeysuckle oh look at these colors of course you know the purple drew my eye right away and when i seen all these colors i was like oh i want to make a poncho that it just came right out i'm like i'm making a poncho okay cool they only had uh three so i bought all three um then I put it aside and I started making everything else under the sun. Never got to make my poncho. So once I got done with the um, the hexagon pullover that I made, I was trying to find something, another color of yarn or something. And I came across this yarn and I was like, oh yeah, I was going to make a poncho with you. So I'm like, that my next wearable okay it's not custom sizable to my body it's kind of but it's still a wearable uh so i'm gonna make a poncho with a hood and um this is just for you know when it got a little chill or if i'm sitting on my mom's porch or i don't know i just want a poncho i made ponchos for everyone like my kids and stuff but i never made one for myself so now's my time um so i'm using the uh super saver um frosted honeysuckle that I just showed you uh this has 482 yards each now I only had three uh oh so I'm also following uh Jada from Jada and Stitches uh following her tutorial uh to make this poncho I'll have that in the description so I wasn't sure if I was going to have enough so what I did was uh i had some of the this red heart super saver ogo yarn in the colorway dusty gray which is this mess right here because <laughs> again i have no patience and when i decide i'm doing something i need to do it right there <laughs> so um oh and i'm also using a size k hook this is not the hook that I started off with, guys. 
uh, I'm going to insert a picture here. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> I was just minding my business, crocheting along, and without any warning, there was no, no warning whatsoever. Like, it wasn't loose, it didn't have a crack, it didn't make a noise, nothing. It just, boop. So then I had to go searching for another K-hook, and of course I can't find anything, because I just have everything shoved everywhere at this point. So I did find this K-hook, so that's what I'm using now. And this is what I got so far. So I started out with the, the dusty gray from here to here. And then here is the frosted honeysuckle. I'll show you the back or front, whatever. So, let's see. Eek. And, ah, okay, let me see. It's not, let's see, I only got, I am like here. So, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. And this is what I have so far, and I love it. I love it, love it, love it. <laughs> and, um, I'm super excited. And it's whipping up really quick, and, um, yeah, so I'm going to make this, I'm going to go kind of long, and I'm going to put a hood, which Jada and Stitches also has a um, video tutorial on how to do that, so I'll be following that. Um, we'll see if I have any of the uh, the color block, the Frosted Honey Suckle, like this color, um, or I might just do the whole hood gray. And I think I'm going to end uh, the poncho with some rounds of gray to kind of give it like a boxed in, like, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But um, this is what I am whipping up on my whippable, wait, not whippable, wearable Wednesday. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... See you guys around. Hope everybody uh, is trying to have some nice calm days coming up because uh, we are in the chaotic part of the holidays. I got my son's birthday on Saturday. He's going to be a teenager. Um, and he's taller than me. My oldest daughter and my son are taller than me. So that's fun. <laughs> but um, yeah, I hope everybody has a wonderful day. And I'll hook up with you later. Bye.